Hey guys, so my camera's dying and I haven't even started and it's like almost 2 in the morning and I have work and I have to be up in 6 hours. But I wanted to film this video because Merry Christmas, it's like still, it's not technically Christmas because it's past midnight but you know like. I haven't gone to sleep yet, so to me it's still Christmas, and I was like, I want to film this video when it's literally Christmas because I want to wear like half the shit I got and use all the makeup and everything, and I slept in today, so whatever, I want to film this video. And really quick, I'm in my basement, so I'm kind of trying to be quiet because it echoes, and I don't know if the lighting's weird, but it's obviously pitch black out, so I clearly couldn't film in front of a window. And this is like the brightest I can get it. Let me see if I can make it a little bit brighter. I really want to get studio lights, but I feel like that's so extra. Okay, first I got this onesie. And I had to wear it because I'm in love. And I have this other onesie. Well, I have one that's really old, but my mom got me one this year. And I low-key wear it like every day. So I was like, I really need a new one. And she got me a new one. I'm obsessed with it. I'm not going to be fake. I'm in love with these onesies and I'm going to live in it so I have to show it. Okay. First, from Madre, I'm not trying to brag in any way. Like, if you don't even, just, let's just avoid that. On Black Friday, we went to Forever 21, which I'll show, and Victoria's Secret, and I picked out, like, stuff I wanted, but it was, like, for Christmas, you know, like, presents, because by that time, I forget, and it's stuff I pick out, so... Obviously, I'm going to like it, but I got this bra because it's on sale for like 20 bucks, and I haven't bought new bras from Troy Secret in so long, and I lost my favorite, favorite fucking one, and they don't make it anymore, and I'm so mad because it's just like, how do you lose a bra, and it was my favorite bra, like, <sighs> so sad, but anyway, I got this one, and it's like a really pretty florally print, so yeah, and then I'll go through this one. Okay. I'm gonna show what I got at Charming Charlie if I have time, depending on how long this is. So I'm gonna put you and do that last. But I have to show you guys, like, I'm obsessed with notebooks. And I found this notebook at Charming Charlie. And I was like, I can't not buy this. Like, I have to. And it says, like, this is literally me. Like, whoever thought of this quote and put it on here, I love them. Like, it says, classy, but I cuss a little. Like, this is literally me. I was like, I have to buy this because I can't see it and not get it. Okay, then I have a bunch of jewelry, which I'll wait. Um, this wasn't for Christmas, but I'm really excited because my mom got me like a little mini tripod. And I always have really ghetto tripods. Like right now, you guys are sitting on, um, if you can see it, you guys are sitting on my old makeup cart. And then a bunch of these little um, containers just put on top of that, so... I'm always using the most ghetto tripods, so she finally got me a real one, and I was going to use it, but then I couldn't show it, so, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Then, in, like, my stocking, I got gum, runs, these M&Ms, but I low-key ate all of them, and then um, these Lifesaver gums. And it's funny, because I literally bought this for my stepdad and put it in his stocking. Oh, and then at Chummy Charlie, I had to show you guys. I found this lanyard and it's so cute because mine from Vera Bradley was so ratchet like oh my gosh and it was five dollars and just look how like ooh like this is so cute, freaking cute okay then I'm so excited about this I sent my mom like a million things I wanted from like Sephora and Ulta like the little sets and stuff for Christmas so I would like be surprised by what she actually picked out and she got me three of these cute little sleeping mask so this one is algae and it's for purifying and detoxing this is the pearl one it's for perfecting and brightening and the green tea one which is for mattifying and anti-blemish but just they're just like these little i'm sorry if i'm really far away i feel like i am but whatever but i like these because i low-key hate face masks because i'm so fucking lazy and i don't want to put water on my face and sit with it on forever and then have to splash water and scrub it off my face so I really only like the peel off mask because that is so satisfying and I don't want to like splash water in my face a million times like 
whatever and these are sleeping masks so it's like you literally put them on go to sleep and then it says in the evening okay of course my camera died but anyway i was just saying that i like these because you put them on and just go to sleep and it says let it work overnight if necessary rinse off excess in the morning which means that it's probably not too heavy because you can sleep with it on and rinse off if necessary so it's not going to be something that like leaves a layer on your face or like a film you know what i mean okay then i got this my mom got me this little like two-faced mini better than sex mascara but it's so adorable because it's in this like christmas packaging like it looks like an ornament and she literally wants to hang it on the tree and then this is a little philosophy um face cream it's the take a deep breath one and it's like Christmassy like ornament too which is so cute and then oh this was like in my stocking it was just like a random hair thing she got me it's matrix heat resistant iron tanner or something you like use it when you get out of the shower and it's supposed to like help if you just blow dry your hair I don't know then dude I saw these online and I still love them but this was so misleading like it was in a little set for Christmas and it's these little beauty blenders but online Obviously, it was zoomed in, but they looked like pretty normal sized beauty blenders. Like, they did not look like they were all the tiny ones you use, like, under your eyes. You know what I mean? Like, they're so cute, but I was like, this was so not what I was expecting. Like, but these are so cute because I've always wanted to try the tiny ones for under your eyes, but I never wanted to buy them. And so I just got these, but there's just a million different shapes, and they're all, like, different colors. It's just a Sephora brand, but I didn't think they were all going to be mini. And my camera's dying again. I ain't my life. Okay. Then, this is this First Aid Beauty Fab Delights thing. And it has a Ultra Repair Lip Cream and just the regular Ultra Repair, like, moisturizer thingy. Because I need a new moisturizer. Like, I've been using, like, the same switch back and forth, like, clean and clear. And this Siesta Cucumber one. Like, I just wanted a new moisturizer. This is a little Becca on the glow like set and I wanted it in opal or moonstone, moonstone or something like that but they were out of that one. So she got me the opal one and I low-key like bought this a while ago but I kind of wanted another one because this powder broke and it's so pretty and I tried pressing it like and it didn't work and I use this thing like every day now so I'm going to need a new one of this soon anyway and this like it's just so upsetting. I don't even use it because it's broken. And I was like, this is so good. I need to. Okay, and then there's just random, like, samples, you know? Okay. Now. Oh, fudge. Okay. Oh, these socks I actually bought for myself. I was going to show them if I had time. But this was, like, OMG so ugly, like, Christmas socks at Target. And this one says Santa Claus. And it's, like, this crazy looking cat. And it's so cute. Then my stepdad always gets me socks, like, for Christmas and my birthday and everything. Like, that's, like, our thing. He always buys me socks, so he got me a million pairs of socks, obviously. Then, okay, this is what I'm most excited about. Dude, so I haven't showed it, but I got a new Michael Kors purse, and it's, like, the white quilted something. But I've never owned a Michael Kors wallet, and my mom sent me this the other day and was like, it matches your wallet or your purse so perfect. And I was like, I hate you, why'd you send me that? Because I want it so bad, but I would never spend my own money, that much money, on the wallet. Like, you know? And she was like, too bad that stuff is so expensive. And I was like, I know, but like, I was just like, oh, why'd you send me that? Because I did not think in any way that she would buy it for me. And I was so surprised. Like, I was so not expecting this, but it's so beautiful. I'm in love with it. And I'm going to show you guys really quick. I got a million gift cards, so I'm just going to show them really quick. I got one to the movie theater near me, because I don't know if it's, like, local, but a Subway gift card. Oh, my grandma got me an iTunes one, which is upstairs, but, yeah. And then I got two Speedway gift cards. Um, Steak and Shake. Oh, Ulta. Love. Guys, the other day I went to Ulta, like, the day before Christmas Eve to buy my mom, like, little sets and stuff and I bought the tartlet in bloom palette because I wanted it so bad but I told my mom way too late for anyone to actually get it for me for Christmas so I was like I'm buying this I want it 
My favorite shade is like Funny Girl or something. It's in the bottom left corner. And I got home and it was broken. And I was so pissed because I always open them and for once I didn't open the palette for some reason and it was actually fucking broken. That's my favorite shade in the whole thing. <sighs> okay. Then I got one to Panera and this one for like Darden. So it's like the only ones near me are Olive Garden, Longhorn, and Red Lobster. But there's also Bahama Breeze, Seasons 22, and Yard House. I've never heard of some of those, but that's nice for like multiple places. Yeah, okay. Hello gift cards. Um, then I got these two candles from Back from Body Works because this is just such a necessity. This one is Twisted Peppermint and it's like frosted glass and it looks so fucking nice and that's just like everyone loves that and has a cute little Christmas tree lid. And then this one, Mahogany Teakwood, which literally just smells like Abercrombie Sexy Men, if you've ever smelled this. And I have one of these, and it's so old, it's used up, but I keep it on my dresser because I just love it so much. I just want to smell it, but I literally can't burn it, and I finally got a new one. And I'm so happy I got another one. I needed that. Okay. Now we're on to the really fun stuff, but i got to go through it fast because I have a lot. But it's the stuff I picked out on Black Friday for Christmas with my mom to get as, like, presents. Because obviously it's stuff... She knows that I like, and I get to spend money on Black Friday, and by the time Christmas comes, I don't remember half of it, so it's still a surprise, but obviously I like everything. Okay, this shirt, I found this on Black Friday, and I went back like three hours later with my mom, and I hid it, and it was gone, and I was so pissed because I couldn't find this shirt, like in the other colors, I couldn't even find it, and I saw this girl with this shirt in army green that I wanted so bad I hid it, and I was like, where did you get this shirt? And she showed me, and she was like, yeah, I got the last army green one. And I was so fucking pissed, because I was like, dude, I came back for that shirt. Like, I wanted to be that crazy Black Friday lady that would be like, I'll give you $5 for it. Like, I wanted to fight her for that shirt. But she took the last one, so I just got it in every other color. So I got this black lace-up one, and then I got it in white. And I got it in this, like, burnt orangey color. Um, but it's upstairs. And I got this red dress from my mom's, like, Christmas dinner party for her work, but I wore it. But I'll insert a picture of me wearing that and the other shirt I got. It's literally just this in, like, a burnt orange color. Then this one, it's similar, but it's, like, cropped in this leisure crop, too. But it's just, like, a teal color. And this has strings. This lace-up does not have, like, the strings hanging. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. And this one's lower. Oh, I feel like I should say prices, just, okay. The one I just showed was $12.90, and all the other shirts are $12.90. And I'm saying prices because I was literally there, so obviously I already know. And if you're watching this as, like, a haul, like, this is, like, a haul of this stuff. And you might want to actually go buy it, so. And I was there, it's like, I knew how much it was, you know, it's like, whatever. This was $12.90, and it's, like, this green, it's from the contemporary, like, section, but it's just this green, slouchy, like sweater but it's like really as comfy as hoodie but it just looks like a sweater and my mom like thinks it's not army green she thinks it's like olive ugly green and she literally hates it but I think it's so cute just saying then I got these pants these are army green like can you see this one's more of like a pea green but they're just leggings and they were 1090 because apparently not being normal leggings having this band makes the leggings seven dollars more and then I got this because I just feel like I could wear this over everything. Everything. And it was a freaking $12.90. That's like the same price as everything in the whole video. But anyway, it's like the slightest bit cropped and it's just this gray zip up hoodie. And with white strings, I just think this would be so cute to throw over anything. Like, oh, it's so cute. Then I got this shirt. It's super basic. It was $9.90. And I thought this would be good for layering under like flannels and stuff. And it's just a black. It's like a little tiny bit cropped. And it's like this. Oh my gosh, what is that called? Not ribbed because it's not just lines. It's like little tiny squares. If you can see. And then this is literally just a hoodie because I love hoodies. So. And it's not cropped, but it's not huge. It's like the actual normal length. And it was... Not so basic collection. Oh, and it was um fourteen ninety, but it was on sale for twelve dollars because you know Forever Twenty One 
low-key has no Black Friday deals at all. Like, they have, like, five things that are, like, advertised because they're cheap, but they're not even on sale. It's a normal price, like, and they have clearance stuff, but they always have clearance stuff. But everyone goes there because they're already at the mall, but low-key, they never have deals, but... That's what I picked out. I'm about to go shopping, Mark. It's the day after Christmas, and I always go shopping. And I know I'm about to wear, like, all this stuff, so I wanted to film this because I'm going to have another haul soon, and they obviously have to be separate. There's too much stuff, and I want to film this on Christmas so I don't procrastinate. So that's everything I got. I hope you guys enjoyed, and sorry I went AWOL for, like, ever, but I'm not even going to, like, address that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love you. Please subscribe because it would literally make my heart so happy, and... I'm like best friends with a lot of you guys. Like I swear it's not like casual, like you just watch me. It's like I really feel like I talk to a lot of you guys all the time. But anyway, leave video requests because I always need them. Always. And subscribe so we can be friends. And give this video a thumbs up because it's like I'm about to get like four hours of sleep for work. And my camera's dying. And I know I'm still not about to go to bed. And I need to edit this. Anyway. I love you guys so much. I hope you have a good day or night, depending on when you watch this. And I love you more than anything. Okay, bye. Oh, and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I fucking love you guys. Bye.